Well, my director here, um, obviously, didn't give me the signal. Five, four, five, four, three, two, one. Action! Hi, Paul here again. And um, this time, what am I talking about? Well, I took a walk yesterday morning. It was a good long walk because I didn't feel like doing anything for my country. Sorry, John and Kennedy. Uh, <laughs> looking around this apartment and uh, I just never have enough money to fix, it, fi fix everything that needs to be fixed. It might sound some familiar to some of you. But look what I found. And see, I don't know if you can see that. I found vault. I found Poland Spring. Oh, Hidden Spring, sorry. Natural ice. McDonald's. Gatorade. I guess when you're an athlete, you uh, toss your stuff out into the garbage afterwards. Mountain Dew. Aquafina. Crystal Geyser. Geyser. Yes. Uh, geyser. Geyser. Uh, let's see what else I found during my walk. Ah, yes. An old but a goodie. Budweiser. So when you're drinking on the road, you can just toss your cans off on the side of the road. Now, what is this video about? Uh, this video is basically about the concept of having these wonderful companies actually clean up their mess. I think it's a good idea. If we had, in our country, a national, and there might already be that, but it hasn't been sponsored, National Cleanup Day, alongside the roads, alongside our streams. This is New Hampshire. And I walk down the streets, and I, I know there are people are out there that are picking up bottles and cans and things like that, and uh, they do a pretty good job. This is a small area, and I was so thoroughly disappointed that when I walk down the road, uh, there is no sidewalk, or there are no sidewalks, at least in my area, or very few sidewalks. But when I walk down the road, I see all these cans. I'm thinking, how come they haven't taken responsibility? Of course, we shouldn't be putting litter on the streets anyway are on the roads. But how come these companies haven't come up with an innovative solution to reduce this waste and get it back into commerce if that's possible or recycle it if possible. Instead what we get is litter on our highways. So Coke, Pepsi, big companies, right? Get together, have a contest to see who could collect the most junk and say a, a period of a week. Cans, bottles. Now let's see who can do that. And I think it would be a great idea. Get together on one idea. See, we talk about, John Edwards talked about, corporate America being terrible, being rotten. And yet, that was only one side of the story because corporate America does do things that are good. But instead they'll, in this, in this concept, or in this idea, they'll run a contest um, to look over under their caps or for ringtones. Well, let's have a contest that sees who could bring in the most trash. <laughs> and I think that'd be a good contest. Clean up America, whatever you want to call it. Um, you know, we talk about change. Here's a small bit of change. Uh, so this is an, um, another novel idea coming live from Enfield, New Hampshire. Not spelt with a D, uh, but Enfield, E-N-F-I-E-L-D. So I guess there is a D in there. Meanwhile, the corporations would love to sell you more ringtones or run a different contest for something else. 
And if anybody ever sees this, maybe. I feel like I'm on Gilligan's Island. I'm trying to get the radio signal out. Um, sitting here on a, a ham radio, a short array radio. I'm trying to get the signal out to the people and seeing what the people could actually do if they are properly challenged. And, uh, so, you know, I mean, I, but I think even in a different concept, if there is no contest, you know, just picking up a, um, a piece of trash along the, the side of the road um, when you see it. Or I was looking at my own garden, I said, you know, including myself, how many people pass by my garden and will say how lovely the flowers are. Maybe they're just paying attention to flowers, but now this time of year, um, I really didn't have something in between. I'm waiting on the um, lilies of the field, and I'm feeling like a lily in the field right now, but I guess the lilies of the field are supposed to be protected, but uh, I don't feel very protected right now. Very venerable spot as far as work, as far as even wanting to do anything, because I really just seem to have given up on our what's happening in our country and it's frustrating and what was my point don't know my point oh the weeds in the garden you know but pluck one weed it's better off Pli plant one flower near a river you know an iris I mean, it's better off so you know this is the idea the concept the belief that we can do things in even small amounts or incremental amounts that would make our country better. Uh, paint one house, plant one garden, inspire one more person. And so, you know, it may not be the best message, it may, may not be the most exceptional message, it might not be the most high energy message today, but that's basically my message. And I thank you for your time.